robot, robot being used in operating rooms for the first time in our state, treating patients right here in our area. And it's the type of technology that you would see used at maybe a Duke University kind of medical center. The doctors here in Wilmington are some of the very first helping patients with the, having back pain problems. Caitlin Stansel joining us right now. She's over at New Hanover Regional Medical Center with a look at the new treatment, hopefully to help a lot of patients. Good morning, Bobby and Kim. This is a really exciting new technology being used for the first time in North Carolina and available right here in Wilmington at New Hanover Regional Medical Center. Mazor Robotic System, what they are using this for is to treat spinal disorders, help people with back pain. And I have Dr. George Huffman here with me to kind of explain a little bit about how you use this robotic system and what kind of patient would be ideal for this surgery. The, um, what this is, it's a robot that allows us to very precisely place hardware in people's spines, uh, specifically screws that go in the bones in the back, in the low back, and in the mid back. Um, it allows us to use far less radiation for getting those screws in than we would conventionally. And it allows us to put them in exactly where we want them. It's very important because before we come into the operating room, we actually plan out the trajectory of the screws. So we sort of go through the process on the computer in our minds and we're able to see where everything's going to go. So when you come in here to the operating room, you already kind of have a blueprint laid out of exactly what you're going to do, where these screws need to go. But what kind of patient is ideal for this kind of surgery? Well, anyone who needs a lumbar fusion, so someone whose back is unstable for some reason or someone who's had a fracture or that type of thing is ideal for this type of procedure. It also allows us to do some things minimally invasively and put the screws in through tiny little holes. Um, it's just very exciting for the patients here in southeastern North Carolina. And what do you think is maybe the most exciting part of using this robotic technology right here in the operating room? I think the most exciting part for me is bring the latest and greatest technology to our patients and, and it, it, it's the ability to do the things that we have been doing for years and years with uh, much more precise and much, um, much less radiation I, I think is, is just awesome. What is the recovery time like for these patients? It depends. Uh, most people are in the hospital anywhere from one to three days and then it takes them about two to three months to get back into their more normal activities. Wow, this is really exciting news, not just for right here in New Hanover County, but also across the entire state of North Carolina, just under 70 other places in the United States using this technology, and the closest really South Carolina and Virginia. This is the kind of stuff that you would see at maybe a Duke University, right? Well, nope, they don't have one yet. <laughs> they don't, but I mean, if you're thinking about this kind of technology, most people's minds go to those kind of facilities. Yes, uh, usually the bigger universities, but uh, that's why we're very grateful that uh, New Hanover has helped us to get this. That is so awesome. Well, we have all these details on our website, WECT.com. You can go there for more information about this really exciting new technology. But for now, back to you guys in the studio.